you for being here thank you for being back um, it is the third week of um, November 2017 and I want to say um, this is going to be um, a wonderful positive week so let's see what does the um, Aries I'm always calling you guys Aquarians this is so weird okay let's see what's going on for the Aries in this week okay so for the Aries this is a full week whatever is going on it is a very very full week for you Aries a lot of changes heartbreak is going to happen for some people we are going to see what that heartbreak is happening for some people so um, let's see um, exactly what is going on um, it is the energy of water all this week whatever is happening it's all about water energy of water this sort of a thing so let's see what is this art break all about um, the tower is here twice energy of the world is there um, so let's see what exactly is happening um, you have the energy of the seven of cups so this is good the energy of the seven of cups is good it's a wonderful positive energy whatsoever is going on you are going to realize that this is going to be extremely good for you guys so um, this is um, new things new opportunities new situations are happening so this is going to be positive so um, there's happiness in this week so let's look at what is going on there's an art break with um, romantic partners so whoever these people are there's an art break that is coming in um, for um, the romantic partners so um, you have to be aware that in this week uh, some of you are going to be outbroken from a romantic partner and let's see why is this happening so who is this person what is the zodiac sign that this romantic situation is going to happen to let's see the princess of wands four of swords and the prince of wands so some of you um the art break the romantic art break is going to affect um, the people between the ages of 18 and 40 so it's going to be the princess of wands and the four of swords and the prince so um, whatever is happening in this week you need to have rest there is a situation that is happening between the energies of these princesses that is happening for you and you need to take some rest so for the people between the ages of um, the people between the ages of 18 and um, 40 uh, you are going to have a, a situation where you are feeling an heartbreak from your partner this is a wonderful situation that is taking place on the second in the second um, Tuesday because you have the energy vibration of the night of the night of Pentacles so whoever the situation is with the night of Pentacles there's a tower that blows up that means something you are going to have a situation with um, someone who is in um, a, um, a Taurus uh, a Virgo or a Capricorn a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn okay and you people could be in a relationship with the, this person who is between the ages of 18 and 40 and there is going to be a situation that is happening there is going to be a hub held in that mean there is going to be a big breakup a big blowout with this person so this person is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the king of um, the king of uh, um, cups this is a very good energy this is a Pisces um, 
a cancer or a scorpion and this is going to be a very very wonderful very very positive um, the energy of the world comes out with this person so if you're in a relationship with someone who's a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion this is going to be extremely good it's going to be um, a powerful powerful time the energy of the world is success coming up with this person and it's going to be a very good success another time the tower so we have twice the tower so we have number 16 we have twice the tower and this energy of the tower you have to do with the three um, the tower so it's upheld that in whatever negativity whatever that was going on there is a, an, a serious up um, up evil and it's as if the universe comes in and blow and blasts up something that was blocking you or that have an effect on your life whatever the situation is there is a blow up from this tower and you are going to be celebrating this ending this is a huge ending and you're going to celebrate this ending and this is going to be good so Thursday is going to be a very very good day on Friday you have a situation with the energy of uh, the um, the Aquarius um, the Gemini of a Libra in an organization and I am going to look to see what exactly is taking place with this person in an organization because obviously um, some of you have to deal with someone who's an air sign in an organization and I am you know the way I'm seeing this is that he's just cutting um, everything and everyone off and this is how so the air people are and sometimes they make big huge mistake and whatever he has done this is an upheld in and this is going to um, end a situation because you have twice the tower tower on Tuesday and the tower on Thursday whatever the situation is as we look at Saturday we have the Queen of Pentacles so someone who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn is going to come in and you have the energy of um, this uh, your own sign so maybe you're coupled with this person maybe there is a situation with this but whatever the upheaval that um, that um, the um, Aquarian or a Gemini or Libra person had done it's coming to an end okay there is going to be a new beginning and you're going to be moving forward you're going to be looking for something else and you're going to be moving forward and this is going to be very good because there is a new start that is coming up for you which is going to be wonderful and positive so um, a lot of people um, in situations and this is showing up as people who at their workplace some um, you know someone is going to really um, stop a situation whatever is happening um, it's as if you're going to hear that um, you know your work is over whatever the situation is and then there's an upheaval because whatever lies or whatsoever that was blocking you there's now an upheaval and you see here on Friday the energy of the Aquarius Libra or Gemini person and there was an upheaval whatever the situation was you're going to decide to move on to something much better and there is going to become a new beginning so this week as we look at this week because you have here the king the king of wands and that is yourself so let's see the king of wands with the um, queen of pentacles and this could be a relationship and let's see what is happening with this relationship ace of one a new start yeah um this king of wands try you're trying to ruin um someone um, um, you're trying to ruin this this queen of Pentacles but you you have to be careful because she is very protected you know you try to bring bring you try to break her down so much but she is very powerful so be careful of what you're doing because the upheaval of the tower the knight of Pentacles this is someone who is a Taurus person so as I look at this reading and I'm looking and I'm reading this reading you can see that you as um, as an, a, a, an Aries man try to do something to the Queen of Pentacles but 
um, is the you know the house of God is the energy of the tower and the tower the tower is here twice whatsoever you have tried to do to this woman it it it, it actually crumbles it is now breaking off whatever you try to block someone who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn person this is um, really because you can see that this person tried to ruin you and working with other but this woman is being protected from you okay and um, whatever is happening it's better that you walk away from the situation because she can ruin you in one minute okay so whatever is happening uh, be aware of your situation because you have been trying to um, to hurt this woman in so much so many ways and you need to stop because you are going to ruin yourself because as I see here and let's look at the organization with the Prince of sword it didn't really work because they realized that you were lying and whatever that you were trying to do okay so be aware um, let's see what's happening with this organization the king of Pentacles happiness and charitable so um, this is going to be good so for the people um, who are working with the organization you had a situation with someone who who was an Aquarius a Libran or a Gemini you're going to see that whatever the situation is um, this um, king of Pentacles um, is taken up for you and happiness and joy and he is going to help help out a situation with you guys okay so this is good so the king of cups he you know this person and gets the energy of the world and this is extremely good this is um, very positive whatever that was happening whatever upheaval um, that was happening there is going to be a celebration it's going to be ended on um, Thursday and there's going to be a, a celebration whatever that was transpiring for the people um, in this week is all about cleansing karmatic situation and letting them go because obviously there was a lot of karmatic situation that was happening with someone the queen of Pentacles because here it is on Saturday you try to ruin this person but then people are working together to protect this person and you need to understand that whatever you do to an earth sign person it's going to come back to you and it's just because of the energy vibration that they carry okay so be aware of that um, this is a wonderful situation because whatever is happening um, there is for the people who are um, connected with the water sign people for the people who are connected with um, the um, the Pisces the Kansas and the Scorpio you're going to have the energy vibration of the world is coming out that means that you are going to be um, you're going to accomplish a lot of stuff because this person is going to help you accomplish it so this is a, um, actually a very good reading for you guys um, you guys have been really receiving good readings on the day less of you are watching these videos because I there was a situation with an Aries that was really an Aries man that was really doing something okay let's look and see what is uh, the good Tarek is saying for you guys what is your energy and you have the messenger of fire whatever the situation is you have the messenger of fire and you need to be aware of the situation because the energy of the messenger of fire is here and whatever that is happened and has transpired um, there is a message that is coming in and we're going to see the messenger of fire is very good because you're also a fire sign and with the messenger of fire coming in it is your own energy vibration which is bringing you a message and let's see what is the messenger of fire saying for you guys so determination for a new adventure innovation independence creativity action um, and and spiritual head strong you have an unstoppable spirit and can co-create all that you desire surrendered by spirit illuminated by the dawn that rises up within you you set forth on a part to innovate 
you trust in your own vision and act accordingly remain in true to what you most valued and desire which can manifest in many forms so this is a good message that is coming in for you fire sign people and it's really from the fire energy so that is another wonderful sense of uh, being let's look and see what the angels of abundance have for you Aquarians let's see what the energy of abundance have for you and you have the energy of a windfall of abundance is coming into you so an increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms some of them unexpected be open to receive and know that this abundance come to you to support your life purpose health and charity work so this is very very good so the windfall of abundance is coming in for you Aries and this is going to be wonderful so isn't this a beautiful reading for you guys I want to say to each and every person out there um, thank you for being here please like share these videos and again I forget to say it at the beginning of the videos but this month is the month of November and in America we're celebrating Thanksgiving I am asking for donations you can use a do the PayPal donation button on um, this channel because I'm supporting the power ministry um, the power ministry fellowship they are an apostolic church and they're in Oakland Florida and they look after the homeless and we are asking uh, for donations to help the homeless for Thanksgiving with clothes but also for to provide them with food so please remember to donate use the donation button on my website I want to say thank you for being here and I will speak to you next week